Hey there everyone, Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome to episode 16 of the Diamond Dimensions Modded Survivor where I play my custom mod pack. Hopefully you have joined me for most of this series so far and last time, what did we get up to? Well, my little mini me, Dan TDM, has unfortunately passed away which is really sad and we've got a problem with far over here far as an issue he cannot get out of the the pond right there so we are going to leave him for a little bit and just sleep and then we'll go and help him because it's a bit safer so yeah we had a little far he is working his butt off in the farm and he is doing a great job and last time i figured out that well between last time and now i figured out that dan tdm i just went into his options and selected all mobs so that is why he attacked the leaf ladies and why he died so what have we got to do now we've got to go and find some chickens because we need some eggs to make our little minions and we haven't got any basically so what we're gonna have to do is go into i think we've got the needles necessary we've got one we've got two needles so let's go and do this let's go and grab them now far has been swimming in this for about for all overnight and i've actually figured out something as well with the hunger situation so they do have a little bit of um hunger they have their own like personal hunger bar which is cool and i couldn't see it properly because it's on a i'm on a higher resolution than the mod was designed for so as you can see here behind this entities to attack button there is a hunger bar and there's also health as well so his health is regenerating because he's got full hunger now and as long as i leave like a steak or something in his inventory he should be fine so that should be okay and yeah, let's go and find some. See, look, he's gone up to 13 now. He's even growing up. So what we can do um, when we get back and we've got more clones is start making some glycerin melons because we've definitely got enough melons. And I'm pretty sure we've got enough gold to um, sort that out because I think one gold equals like nine nuggets. So we've got the opportunity to make some giant clones that have 20 HP and stuff like that. So what is going on here? Look at this. It's just a <laughs> I think an enderman has been here. I think so. Look at that. That is crazy. So what we need to find is not sheep. We need to find cows and we also need to find chickens. But chickens are our main priority right now. I think you can take more than one blood sample from a chicken or from one animal, which should be good. And hopefully that is the case. But I'm just going to run along here and see if there is anything around. I'm not too sure. Um, I think down there. Oh my god, there is one right there. Look at that. I turn left and there's a chicken. Oh my god, there's three. We can take all of these. Now I am just going to, uh, what am I going to do? I haven't really got any eggs. I could just wait around here until they, um, make some eggs. Shall I do that? I don't really know. I could have bought some wheat with me. That would have been pretty simple, wouldn't it? Um, I don't think I've got any. Where have we got? Have we got anything to speed up the egg process, sir? We need you to, please lay an egg. We need you to lay an egg right now. Come on, they're swimming right now. We can't have them swimming. We need them laying eggs because I've only got, I think I haven't, I don't think I've got any eggs left, which is a problem. And you look at me like that. I'm going to stab you with this needle right now. Right, I think I'm going to go back and get some wheat and try and lure them back because I think that's what they eat. Is that what they eat? I hope so. Or I can grab some seeds as well. Let me try. No, I haven't got any seeds on me whatsoever. So I, at least I know where the chickens are. That is a good thing. So they're kind of like over this way so let's go back and get some wheat and see if that is the case and oh lag spike has made me fall into the the world oh my god it's made me fall into the river and almost drown so we're getting a little bit of a lag spike um now and then but that is just because uh the the generation is just crazy right now it's still generating every time i reload the world look we got we got problems here look at this the Endermen are going crazy there must be Endermen around look at that there's a there's a bit of tree missing there's a bit of tree on the floor and yeah, that's a bit crazy. That's, that is a bit crazy. And far, it looks like he's fallen in again. So we need to make a bridge for that guy. Because I think the water still works if you've got a bridge over it. So yeah, that should be okay. Far, come on, buddy. You need to sort this out. He wants that. Look how badly he wants that melon. Oh, he's got it. It's fine. That's fine. <laughs> what well, these melons and pumpkins are really growing. Look, they're really like a maximum kind of grow. Uh, whatever you call them. Maximum size. And then they should be able to grow loads. So that should be good. We've got those. It's just the um, the wheat that's taken ages. So hopefully he's got some on him. I'm not sure. He might have replanted them and stuff like that. So let's go and check him out. That's what I'm going to do first actually. I'm going to see if he's got any. And then I can see if I've got any in my inventory. So let's... Oh, there is some in here. But I want to see how he's been doing. I want to see if he's actually been working hard on these um little wheats here what has he got he's got one wheat and two seeds so he has he has at least broken one and he has replanted it as well so let's grab just the two wheats for now and we'll go and get those chickens back we definitely need those we we just need eggs that's that's all we need eggs eggs so i, I think we have only got actually i don't think we've got none i think um we used that last one on far 
and then uh, Dan TDM, he died, unfortunately, so we're going to have to make him uh, reborn again. And other than that, I just want to get this farm going really efficiently. And I think I'm going to take some or try and find some more seeds. Actually, let's do that right now. Let's see if we can get some more seeds going on. So I want to kind of make all of that little patch where he's um, where far is farming into seeds. Unfortunately, or fortunately, we can put some radish seeds down. I don't even know if we can. Um, I don't even know what you do with them, to be honest. We've got radish seeds and normal seeds. We're going to plant some of them as well. Why not? Because it's part of the legend gear mod right then. Now we've got some seeds. We've got no sheep. I don't want you. Sorry. We need to grab this chicken or some of them. Maybe they've laid eggs over time. Who knows? Have they got any eggs? Uh, sir, have you have you laid any eggs right now? If we put a lever next to him. Initiate eggs. Initiate eggs. Come on. <laughs> we all know it doesn't work like that. So let's grab the wheat and hopefully this shall work. Follow me, chickens. Follow me. So let's try and lure him back to our... Oh my god, he's not even looking at me. I thought you were looking at me. Come on, I thought you were. What about seeds? Do you like seeds? He likes seeds. Come on. Get out of the water. Stop mucking around. Follow me right now. Right now. Over here. Let's see if we can get... Come on. Stop, stop playing around now. He's just kind of like flitting in and out of the water. Get out of here. Right now, follow me. Please say you follow me. He's not actually doing anything. What? Oh, I don't want to kill you right now. I don't want to do this to you. He is kind of following me, but then just falling in the water. This is going to take a very long time if you continue to do this. If you continue to be like this... Oh, an egg! That is beautiful. That is what I wanted from you. That's fine. That's all I wanted. What can I get rid of? I need to get rid of just one thing. And uh, I guess one bone meal won't. Oh, it will do. Oh, no. Dirt. Get out of here. Right, fine. We didn't need the chicken after all. He just laid an egg instead, so we don't need that. That's fine. At least I learned... Why does that keep happening? Those spikes. That is really annoying. And I know it is Minecraft rather than my computer because it did um, it did handle it before. But for some reason, it's just not liking it right now. So I don't know what to do about that. Maybe I can turn down a bit of the uh, render distance or something like that. But I'll get to that later. We shouldn't have any lag near our house, which should be good. Right, we finally got this egg. So now we can... Oh my god, I forgot to stab the chicken with the needle. I'll be back in a second. Right, we got this. We're back, chicken. We're back for your blood. So we're going to take your eggs and your blood. So come over here. Come over here. Stab. There we go. Oh my god, I took my own blood. I didn't want that. I didn't want to take my own blood. Oh my god, how can I get rid of that right now? I don't think I can. Oh my god, that is going wrong. So let's come over. I need to get a really good aim on this, otherwise I'm just going to make myself ill again. Here we go. I'm aiming at the chicken. Did I get it? Did I get it? I don't think I got it. I don't think that works. Why is that not working? It should work on chickens. Come here. Come here, you little punk. Okay, I've got hunger and weakness right now. That is not good. That is definitely not good. Oh, I thought this worked. So we're going to have to lure these chickens all the way home. I don't even know how this is going to work. It definitely works on... It definitely works on mobs because I have used it before. But I don't know why it's not working on this one. I can't, like, force him all the way over here. Or can I? Can I? Okay, guys, it's fine. I'm an idiot. We need to not right-click them. We need to hit them with it. So I've wasted one needle, and I'm pretty hungry right now because of that. So all I have to do is hit him with it, and now I have chicken blood. So that worked fine. Thank God. Look at that. He's got all the, the debuffs that I had. Poor thing. I'm so sorry. But what have we got? I don't know how I can empty this. Can I just... Uh... Oh, I might be able to do it like this. Yes, look at that. That is... That's pretty smart, me, actually. I've never... Never had that many good ideas on this survival and my... Oh my god, why is this always full? Let's do this and... That's my blood separated. So I can clone myself again and I've got an empty needle again. So I can um, stab this chicken again. Sorry, I'm really sorry. This chicken's going to die. Yes. I mean, no. No. <laughs> the chicken died. But anyway, let's let's carry on with this. We finally got our chicken. Um, but it always does it when, <laughs> when I'm over that one particular piece of lake. Why? That is just weird. So let's um, carry on going through. We are very hungry right now. Probably because I stabbed myself with a needle. So let's, uh, let's just grab some melons. It's fine. Everyone grab melons and eat them. Did you... No. No. Did you... What am I... Why did that even happen? Oh, that is freaky. What the hell? Everyone saw that. I caught it on tape. The melons turned into seeds, and then back again. I even stacked the seeds on top of each other, then removed them for the melons to come back. That is weird. But anyway, let's uh, get back, because we're getting very distracted right now. Things are going things are going sketchy for the first 10 minutes of the episode, I'm not going to lie. I messed up with the chickens. I thought I was going to have to lure it all the way back, 
but thank God I don't. I just had to research. And Far is really having some issues here. Every time he goes in there, he is stuck. So get up, get up. There you go. Collect that pumpkin and do what you will with it. So I did get two eggs, which is cool, because that means I can make a couple of chickens, which will hopefully bear me some eggs. But I do need another test tube now because I used the other one to fill with my own blood. So let's just keep all the blood-related stuff in here. We've got my blood separate. I've already got a vial of my blood. How has this even happened? I didn't know that. Wow. So, yeah, no chickens in there. Actually, no eggs. I meant, I meant eggs. It's fine. We need to get some... I can do that. I can do that. Grab some more test tubes. I need one. I, need, I only need two right now. But where's the other one gone? Let's just grab this and... Oh, no, it's not going to be enough. Oh, yes, it is going to be enough. It's fine. Let's go up here. And finally, start separating some blood. I should be able to put all four of those in there. What was that? Did you see that? Oh my god, there's ghosts. There's ghosts in here. That's not good. I, I can't be dealing with ghosts right now. So we can take all of these and should be able to put them all in at the same time when I've made them. That's going to be cool. That is going to be cool. So I'm going to put the iron sack in here. Just some fences as well. And you did realize, or you did realize what I didn't in the last episode. That I did have some, some fences in here. They're right here. But anyway, we can use those for later on, so I'm going to need some more pens for more animals. Right, let's put our blood, or the chicken blood, next to this. Create a chicken blood capsule thingy, and then put another one in here. And we've got four test tubes that we can now make um, spin round at the same time. I'm not sure what the correct term for it is, but we can do that. Let's put all of them in here. It might take quite a while, but we will have... Oh, no, I need to separate my bloods. Oh, no, I only need um three. That's fine. I can spin those. This could take a while. Look how slow this is going up. But I can make a mini-me again. I've got some bone meal. I've got an egg. This is all I wanted. This is beautiful. So I'm going to sleep first. These days are going really, really quick. And then finally, we can get Dan back, mini Dan, back into the uh, series. Because that was that was a pretty short showing from last time. He, he made a mistake and he paid for it. So that's grab i keep forgetting what i'm gonna do we need to grab what we need for a human egg so i need to put this back in here to make my dna and then I need dna an egg and a bone meal to make a human egg now my next um little experiment needs to be a chicken otherwise we are not going to get eggs at a, at a quick enough rate so let's put this egg down and now we can make mini me again yay finally it's been a while it's been too long without him it was a sad day when we lost him, actually, because it was really unexpected. I wasn't even planning on to record that bit, but, <laughs> you know, bad things happen. So let's put all of it like this and then into there like that. Round here and we should be good to go. Let's incubate this bad boy. Look at this. Yes, yes, look at this. We've got uh, 39 minutes, 51 seconds, but, you know, the cheating way. We can just keep doing this and bear our mini-me again who should help us fight and stuff like that. So there, we've got 15 minutes left now. Little do we know, we've got a lever that can cheat our way to it. Well, we've got two minutes. It's fine. Yeah, Steve, let's do this. Right, we need to turn his roaming off quickly. Curious off. Um, pick up items off. All them, um, all the things are off right now. And we need to change this back to me. Come on, let's do this. Did I do that properly? I can't properly see because my fraps counter is in the way. But I think I spelled it right. Here we go. Follow me, you punk. Come here. Where are Ah, oh, yes, there we go. Mini-Me is back. He is a little bit smaller than before, but we're not going to worry too much about that. We can just make some glistering melons. It'll be fine. Let's do that, actually. We could do that. We've got so many melons that we've got... Oh, no, d stop it. <laughs> That's the only issue with them picking everything up is that they want to pick absolutely everything up, and he's stolen my redstone, you little punk. Right, he's got... Oh, my God, look how many melons he's got. That is beautiful. And he's getting bigger as well. He's a level 15. Right, come on, Dan, little Dan. Let's do this. Need to make some glistering melons. And I'm going to check on this, actually. Check on the uh, little chicken progress. So what this will give us at the end will give us just two chicken spawn eggs and one of mine, which is cool. So we can, we can even clone me again this episode. That is how well things are going. Actually, no, we can't. We need to spawn our chicken and make sure that we get an egg from it, otherwise we're just wasting our eggs. And it seems to be that these little guys have issues with the little um, the little jumps there, which is bad. So, um, yeah, sorry about that, little little Dan. So we're going to make you bigger. Let's do that. We've got so much gold right now, we can do that. Um, let's put one in. I don't even know how much we need. We just need to... Let's just grab 18 and then put all of our melons together. Put them all together and um, 
Feed them. <laughs> oh, God. Too many melon references. Let's do this. Feed him that. Oh, he hasn't got pickup items on. We need to go to options. Pickup items. There we go. Look at that. He's growing to level 11. And now we just keep throwing these on until he gets there. There we go. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. He should be at 16 when he's done with these. Oh, yeah. Look at that. We need some more now, though. At least we've got enough melons and so much, so much gold that we can do this. Um, Give me the melons, far. Wait, give me the melons. Give me the melons. Got 20 there. That should be enough to um, heal both of them. And they're getting bigger. This is beautiful. All right, let's go into here. Grab some. Oh, we don't even need some more of these. We can. Sh we should be. Yeah, that's enough. Awesome. Oh, I didn't know you could get melon seeds by putting melons just straight in a crafting table. Don't know why I didn't know that. But um, come here. Come here, you little punk. We need to throw melons on you. There you go. There's four. There we go. He should be 20, which is enough. That is the maximum he can be right now. Look at him. It's 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 pretty much identical. Yay! <laughs> so that is us. Um, we finally got him big, and we need to we need to give him his stuff back. He had a diamond sword right here. Um, this is my diamond sword, the one that's broke. I can give him a leather cap. I can give him the chest plate. I don't know where I got that cap from, actually. Uh, that's weird, but uh, yeah, that is cool. Look at him, beautiful. So we need to go into entities to attack and be very careful with this now. So we want to just kind of select. I don't know, there's so many mobs in these... Oh, look how big that is, the Hydra. My god, look at that. We need to just turn it down on the that one. That one is dangerous. The rest should be okay, I think. We can put them down as well. Um, but the rest, we're just going to have to kind of wing it with that. Let's see what happens. But to be honest, we just need to keep the leaf ones off because those are the most dangerous um, because they do fight back and hit really, really hard. And yeah, that's what that's the story of that so let's um put some seeds in here and we need to plant some radishes let's just put the radishes just here so we know what they are why can't we plant these get off that get off that so it doesn't look like we can plant radishes unfortunately but what can we use them for then tell us tell us too many items nothing we can actually use them for nothing beautiful so we're just going to shove these in the chest and leave them there there's nothing we can do with them so we've got big dan tdm and we've also we need to level up uh far as well let's do this come on far oh my god he mines from behind himself that is awesome so we'll just wait for him to finish doing his stuff come on pick this up and then we can make sure that he gets big via the melons go on in there's, there's two three four that should be enough no you want one more you want one more do you there you go take one more and you should be good to go there we go level 20 we've got two big minions this is amazing look how awesome this is so he should be fine right now his clone has yeah we, we just need to give them like a little bit of food each so i'm going to give him three and then go into him and give him four or maybe i don't know i don't know why he's got a pumpkin in his inventory but i'm just going to change my resolution just so you can see this so you can see at the top left there there is a hunger bar but i don't know it's um only on that larger resolution but anyway as soon as they are regenerating health we know they're at least on hunger and we just keep them topped up on food it should be fine what we've got to do now, we need to go and check on our blood and see if that is finished. I think it should be close to finished. There we go. Look at all this separated blood. This is gross. Look, chicken blood separated. Two chicken bloods and they don't stack, unfortunately, and mine. So we can go and craft ourselves a chicken because we've only got one egg left. That's sad, but <laughs> we've only got one egg. Have we got any bones? We should do, surely. I think I threw them out earlier, but we have got one. It's fine. Thank God for that. That would have been a bit embarrassing. There we go. We need to put the needle in, the chicken blood. Now we've got chicken DNA. Put an egg, which is also chicken DNA. And we've got a spawn chicken. So if we made an anvil, we could name this guy. And I think we're going to. We're going to do this. We need to make an anvil. I th oh, mind you, I think you need so much iron and we don't even have any. Um, oh my god, you need so much iron. 9, 18, whatever that is. That's a lot. I know that's a lot. What have we got? I think we've only we've only got 14. That's terrible. That's actually really bad. I don't think we have any any smelting either, which is unfortunate. I don't think we have any ores. So there goes that idea. And I'm not in 1.6 either because the mods aren't updated. So I can't make a name tag. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to name this guy. Or shall I do it off camera and be sneaky? Right, we're just going to spawn this guy by himself because, you know, it's survival. I can't really cheat, even though I'd like to. And maybe we can get name tags in in the future just to name him up. But anyway, let's go for this. Um, just spawn chicken. We can't get attached to these just in case they die, I guess. We can get attached to our minions, but not the not this guy. So let's um, go into here 
and we should be able to spawn this guy in. It's our baby chicken. Oh, he's actually an adult chicken. That's beautiful. Look at that. So we spawn this guy in, and now we just need to wait on him to lay eggs, which is what you really do with chickens. So we're going to have to wait for that. Get out. Why are you in there? Stay out of there. Don't be... A, don't be pestering the chicken he's got some serious laying to do or she i guess it should be a she um what do we need to do next oh he's got an iron sword we could have given that to one of our little i can't remember what to do with these iron sacks i can't remember what to do with them oh no i know i know what to do with them you just right click them i think there we go what do we get we got an iron axe um i guess that's helpful i don't really know that's from the grimoires mod it's pretty um strange but handy, I guess. It's a free iron weapon. It's okay. It's a free iron weapon. And then we'll just put our blood in there just for now. Just a, a few other blood recipes. Got another chicken in here. We're doing pretty well, actually, with these clones now that we've got Dan TDM back. Just get out of the chicken pen. Why are you bothering him? Stop bothering the chickens. What's your problem? Get out of here. Get out. No. Oh, my God. That was close. You are pesky. Good job we didn't name you. I would be really, really angry with you right now. So, I guess we could get far to pick up eggs. Uh... Oh, no, I think you can't specify the items that you want them to pick up, but you can specify what you want them to break. I think that's the rule. Right, I need a plan of action right now because I'm losing my train of thought. Let's put our gistering melons in this cupboard here with the bowls, because why not? And now I need to think of a plan. Okay, I was going to make a spade, actually. I need to make a spade because... I don't want the the wolves and stuff trying to get into my chickens or stuff that can just kill. I'm just going to make a gold one for no reason. And um, just get rid of some of this dirt. Because if they jump over here, they will be able to get in, which I don't want to happen. Unfortunately, I just made a gold one for no reason. But I don't know why I did that. I know that's stupid. But anyway, it, it does the job for now. Right, that should be fine like that. Um, they shouldn't be able to jump in. And over here. They shouldn't be able to jump in anyway. No, that should be fine. There's nothing in there anyway. This is fine. It's fine. I can't believe I just made something out of gold. Why did I do that? Right, it's, it's getting to night. This this farm is working really nicely. I'm liking this. Well done, far. Well done. Let me just see how many seeds he's got on him. He's only got... Oh, he's got four seeds. I'm going to plant two of those for him. Just so that he can make more seeds. Oh, there's a pumpkin. Go far. Do it. Look at him. I don't think they'll have as many problems getting in and out of the water now. Because they are giants, basically. They're the same size as us. We need to sleep right now. And now I need to think of... I think we're almost ready after we have enough eggs to incubate, like, some more human eggs. We can start keeping our, like, our home base automated while we go off and explore some more dimensions. So the first dimension I think I'm going to do is the Atom, because it's the easiest to get to, and it's also pretty damn sweet as well. Why are you still in there? He slept in the chicken pen overnight. Please don't tell me you're picking up his eggs, either. Yeah, I guess you could do. That'd be pretty handy, actually. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, the other Dan was better. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to come out and say it. The other Dan was a little bit better. He was a little less chicken obsessed. Oh, I need a plan of action. Wasn't I, I was going to make a better spade. Because I'm going to keep... I don't know why I made that. I don't really want to make... It's because I guess I don't want to make an iron spade. But gold is even worse than, like, stone. So, have I got any sticks? I've got some sticks in here. Let's make a couple of stone spades. I don't really want to use my iron, as I just said, because... They're very precious and I need to get some sand. The iron is wearing thin right now. I think I need to go out of Dan TDM and um, go and find some iron because he can mine as well, which is pretty sweet. So we're going to do that later. We're going to do that in the next episode. But for now, we need to go and grab some sand because we need to make some sandstone. And I think you can make it out of that. I'm pretty sure. Um, I could be being a, a complete noob right here. But I'm pretty sure you can make it. Uh, we need sandstone. Yes, you can. Just four sand. We'll make sandstone. So let's go and raid all of this. And that should end out the episode, I think. I'm not too sure, though. I need to check the time. And, um, yeah, things are going pretty well. We got back on track with our clones. We cloned one animal so far, which is a good start, even though it's just a chicken. But that is the start of our clone empire. Oh, my God, I didn't mean to do that. No, no. I knew that would go wrong. <laughs> so, yeah, our clone empire is now... How many strong? Three. And then we can get more... Um, eggs from the chickens which is the, the almighty plan so that should be good it's working out pretty nice let's get out of here come on dan we need to mine even more sand get enough sandstone so we can make this awesome portal and we also have enough for the scarab already which we can make in the next episode this little golden scarab here we only need four gold and a diamond which 
we definitely have. It feels good to have so many diamonds and so many resources. And the only resource we're kind of running out of is iron, which is strange, I guess. <laughs> so I'm going to, I think I'm just going to end the episode here because it seems like a nice way to end it. We've got loads of clones and now we have lots of sand. So f let's get home and kind of end the episode there. And yeah, DanTDM, follow me, little punk. And let's go and see how Far's doing. We've got two clones that are fully grown, thanks to the Glistering Melons. They're both working fine. They're both in great health, and everything is great. And we've got our little chicken over here, who laid an egg. What an amazing way to end the episode. Well done, little chicken. You are doing us proud. So now we can make another clone for next episode. Everything is good. So yeah, thanks for watching this episode, guys. This series is getting really enjoyable to play now. It's just... Um, finally coming together we just need a bit more iron and we should be good to go to the next dimension and kit up dan tdm in all these diamonds so yeah that is pretty much it for me today guys i hope you enjoyed you can go and play this um, mod pack even though it's an earlier version i'm working on getting it updated to the mods that i have now it's just a lot of work but i'll let you know when i do that the link is in the description below if you want to play with most of the mods mainly the dimension mods and yeah, that's pretty cool. So um, if you do happen to be new to the channel, then please do hit that subscribe button. And if you did enjoy the video, then please do leave a like for more of this series. So yeah, I will see you all next time on Wednesday for more Diamond Dimensions. Goodbye!